Well, teenage skin can sometimes be problematic. If you don't have problematic skin, that's absolutely fine. Brilliant, well done. But problematic skin can happen in these years. What causes it? It's actually hormone changes and the hormone changes in your body through puberty actually stimulate the oil glands in your skin. And that either causes more greasiness and more shine, but it can also cause the surface of the skin to become unbalanced, which might cause infections and therefore more spots on the skin. Now this may happen on the face, on the chest and on the back. These are the common areas. But what can you do about it? Well, what you should do is just have a very simple cleansing regime, maybe a cleansing wash, something not too greasy or heavy, that's fine, but with antiseptic ingredients like tea tree, things like chamomile, aloe vera, lavender, these sorts of ingredients are gonna suit your skin. And then follow with some form of moisturizing gel. It doesn't have to be greasy, heavy or thick, a gel to help balance that again might have propolis or tea tree aloe in there because that will keep your skin more in balance and help to prevent the spots from scarring. Now, if the spots are very severe, there's more than about 10 or 15 at a time, they're swollen, they're sore, or there's maybe as many as 50 or 100 on your face or your chest or your back at one time, then really that's going to a medical condition and you do need to go along to your GP and they will have solutions for you and they can get your skin back into good condition for you. But the other thing you can do is concealment. Now, concealment's really easy. It doesn't always have to involve the obvious of concealers or foundations or makeup, but if they do, try and choose free from makeup. So that's makeup that actually has more healthy ingredients, especially if it's got pure mineral ingredients or again, those plant-based skincare ingredients I mentioned, because that will complement your skincare regime. But if you can't or don't want to wear makeup, self-tan on the guys as well as the girls is brilliant because a little coat of self-tan actually on Caucasian or white skin will take the redness down out of the spot and then it is not so noticeable. And if you follow these simple steps as well as being very, very crucially putting SPF factor on normally as well because that will help to keep the skin in balance for you and won't affect the spots because that has had a medical certification for you. So SPF is crucial on holiday or when you're in the sun. But if you follow those simple steps, then you should be able to get through the spotty stage without coming out with scarring in the future in later years.